Hello Sagittarius, welcome to a bonus love reading and it's going to be a general love reading as always. So it will not resonate with every Sagittarius. So you know the drill. All right, let's get into this. Spirits, angels, guides, what messages do you have for Sagittarius? What's coming their way in love for Sagittarius? What is coming their way in love? In the recent past, we have the Nine of Swords. How you think or view this person. The High Priestess Reverse and the Five of Pentacles. Interesting. What's going on in your connection? The Tower Reverse, Eight of Cups Reverse. How they view you or think of you here. The Lovers Reverse. The magician reverse okay a lot of gemini energy here and in the near future we have the five of cups bottom of the deck the page of pentacles interesting so what i see here is um i feel with eight of cups reverse that someone wants to come back or they if they're in a situation where they want to get out of it they are delayed or kind of blocked from doing so um i feel like you found something out with the high priestess reverse or perhaps you have something to say um maybe there's some sort of secret being revealed to you um i don't know there's been worry and stress here and i feel like it's on both of your parts because i have the nine of swords here in the past and the five of cups in the present or in the near future sorry I have a tower that possibly has already fallen. This person can't manifest something, your person, and then you feel out in the cold. So I feel like both of you are kind of in a funk here. Let's get some energies. What are the energies surrounding this connection spirit? For Sagittarius, please. What are the energies? surrounding this connection. Let's get some more information here. This one. Divine timing. Faith, fortune, destiny, trust in divine timing. First card out. Interesting. Okay. What else for Sagittarius? What are the energies? Victory lap. Success, recognition, triumph. You're being recognized and admired for your success. What I'm seeing here is like spirit is guiding you towards success here. It looks like with divine timing and victory lap. Then we have time out at the bottom. So it's like timing. Timing is of the essence here. Let's get some more information. <clears throat> Tell me about this nine of swords. What is this nine of swords about? The four reverse. Tell me about the nine of swords. Interesting. Got the five of swords reverse and the four of wands reverse. I feel like something happened to de destabilize a connection. And I don't know. It's it's almost like if someone wants to reconcile here, there's fear and anxiety. Um, perhaps because certain steps aren't being taken right now or something's very risky yeah someone here doesn't want to sacrifice they're unable to let go of something i feel like this is just causing more disappointment and heartbreak with the hangman reverse this is someone that is i feel too stuck or or feeling too stuck to have a breakthrough or a new beginning here and this happened in the past tell me Hold on. Tell me about the High Priestess reverse. What happened here? Um, Sagittarius, I have you here. I have your person on this other side, but it can be flipped. Flip it if it resonates for you. Tell me about the High Priestess reverse. What's this? Yeah, you found something out, like clear as day. Look at this. Seven of Swords reverse, High Priestess reverse. You found something out. Something came to light. You saw something or someone very clearly here. Can I get one more for the High Priestess Reverse? 
yeah, the devil. This was um, a very difficult situation here. Something possibly toxic, an unhealthy attachment. Um, this could be addictions, decisions that lead you down paths that aren't the best or the healthiest. Um, you found something out. Yeah, this could have been, this could have led to a breakup or it could have felt like a big loss. Um, this could have led to financial losses, whatever choice this was. Why is the five of pentacles down here? You could have ghosted this person. Um, yeah. Oof. Look at all this. We have the Ace of Cups reverse, the Emperor reverse, and the Queen of Wands reverse. This is heartbreak, disappointment, anger. Could be dealing with an Aries. And then the Moon, Pisces energy. So I feel like this is regarding what you didn't know. There was doubt, confusion, and illusion here. I'm not going to take these because there's too many, but I wanted to read that. Tell me about the Five of Pentacles. If they want to come out, back out, that's fine. Tell me about the Five of Pentacles. Queen of Cups about the five of pentacles i feel like even though you were upset i feel like you probably cut communication off with this person even even though you were upset or disappointed at what happened i feel like there's still emotions here and it's almost like maybe the conversation or communication was stopped or whatever progression or movement your connection was in came to a like dead stop something didn't take off here with ace of wands reverse because of what happened Tell me more about this Queen of Cups. Yeah, you were heartbroken, I feel, because maybe you thought this was your soulmate here. I think you were heartbroken, disappointed, but you still have a lot of, the feelings are still there, that you can't just get rid of them. Okay, so what happened here? Why is the tower reversed? What happened here with this tower reversed? Okay, what happened with this tower reverse? Okay, well, judgment and the six of wands reverse. Someone has had some sort of awakening, has made some sort of judgment call here. I think someone's choice led to a tower moment. Perhaps someone, you know, left a connection, wants to return. This could be somebody that wants a second chance as well. Tell me more about judgment. Tell me more about judgment, please. Yeah, this is someone that I feel wants to heal the connection. Or, well, I got the chariot reverse, king of swords reverse. Okay, never mind. Page of swords. Cancer energy with the chariot reverse. Interesting. So what I'm getting is if, if this is somebody that wants a second chance, they're not moving and they're not communicating. They might be watching you, but there's no actual movement being taken. Um, this could be somebody that literally cannot leave a situation. Like let's say this is a third party situation and someone is with someone else. They're not able to leave. If this is someone that wants to heal a connection or wants to move on from a connection, they can't do that fully. And I think it's because they don't have all of the information. Tell me about this Eight of Cups reverse. Why is the Eight of Cups? We got the Strength card, Leo energy, Courage, Control, Compassion. Why is the Eight of Cups reverse? Wow, Queen of Swords reverse. How about Ace of Wands upright this time with the Nine of Cups reverse and the Fourth? Okay. So I feel like there is a person here who's either not going to be happy that someone returns or who is keeping someone from returning. Tell me about this Queen of Swords reverse. Why is this Queen of Swords reverse? Yeah, it's almost, yeah, Three of Cups reverse. There's somebody in the way here. Someone that, I feel like someone wants to break free of a situation, but this Queen of Swords reverse is in the way. 
of a path. It's like they're literally in the way of someone's path. Hmm. Tell me if this is resonating down in the comments. Tell me about the lover's reverse. I feel like when this person thinks about you, they think about the regret over a choice. Like they, they're regretful here. Yeah, the Hierophant reverse. This is someone who um, possibly is the one that broke up with you or separated from you or the one that's separating from a third party. Taurus energy. What fell on the floor? Two of Pentacles, yes. This is someone that made the wrong choice. They probably chose someone else over you and now they're stuck. Um, and that other person could be a parent, it could be um, a job, it could be finances, it could be a current partner. Um, there's an interference here. They made the wrong choice. Whatever that choice was. Tell me about the Magician Reverse. Yeah, they're trying to heal the situation or they have a different wish here with the star, Aquarius energy, but I don't think they're able to manifest it. Hermit, wow. Virgo energy and this is all about like healing, figuring out their next steps. They're trying to manifest something. I feel like they're imagining something here. Yeah, they want to restore balance, but I don't think, I think there's a, someone in the way, this Empress reverse. It's like it's 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 like they're they're being held on to. If there's not a third party, I really don't know how this reading would apply to you because for some reason I just keep getting there's an interference here. It's like this person cannot give something to you because they're you know they can't manifest, they can't make something happen, and they can't. I feel like it's because either they're holding on to something. Or someone's holding on to them. Tell me about the Five of Cups. Why is the Five of Cups here? The Moon Reverse and the Eight of Swords Reverse. This is somebody that wants to break free. They're stuck in the past and they want to break free here. So why the Five of Cups? very interesting to me because this is someone that possibly their fear is no longer getting in the way this nine of swords right like tell me more about the five of cups this might be a surprise seven seven of wands reverse can I get one more for this moon reverse why is the moon reverse? Okay, so what I'm getting here with the moon reversed, um, there's an illusion that is being seen clearly or something, a secret coming to light or something hidden coming, coming to the surface. Um, I feel like it's someone's decision. For some reason, I feel like, you know, whatever decision, whether someone wants to return or wants to have a new path that they're on or whatever decision they want to make here, um, I feel like it's going to be a surprise. I feel there's going to be some sort of loss. Um, I feel, you know, if, if it's almost like this person's thinking about the past and it causes them to either re have a realization or make a different decision. Um, I feel like they're, they're breaking free of whatever fear was holding them back. Um, maybe they could even be breaking free of a third person, the person that's in the way. But I feel like there's delays or there's financial difficulty for this person. Um, this person I think is, is having it, you know, finding it hard to face the opposition. Um, the opposition could be a partner. Yeah. I feel like th there's, see, there's three people here. I feel that this person's in the way. So I'm gonna see what this person is thinking or feeling about you. Tell me what this person is secretly thinking or feeling about Sagittarius. 
What are they thinking or feeling about Sagittarius spirit? Oh, I like could all my cards in my hand. What are they thinking or feeling about Sagittarius? I want forever with you. Expect a message. I keep getting this. Expect a message. And you matter to me at the bottom of the deck. And then let's see what advice does spirit have for you. Any advice or messages for Sagittarius? I think time is important here. I feel like success is only... It's almost like there's still a lot of things that need to happen in order for success to take place. And that's why the timing is so important. Perhaps things are taking a while to develop Sagittarius. But this is like how it's meant to be. What advice or messages do you have for Sagittarius? Open your heart. Any other messages or advice? Okay. Be patient. And think carefully. Be patient, yes. I feel like there's... um. Something slowly coming together. Your wish will be granted at the bottom of the deck. So I think it's only a matter of time before this comes together. I think your person, this could also be you breaking free of something. Um, I feel like that's going to take a little bit of time. All right, Sagittarius, I'll leave it there. If this resonated with you, leave me a comment. Let me know. Hit the like button and subscribe if you enjoy these readings and want to see more. And I'll see you all in another video. Take care.